Andro Ados declared themselves a new human race. This new human race, with Mother Spear at its heart, made tremendous progress and advanced humanity. And the surviving humans, the real humans, they evacuated to an underground facility. Some, led by Raphael Marx, waited here at this facility for an opportunity to strike back. During this time, the surviving humans evolved in order to gain the strength to face the androids. The result of genetic engineering and rapid evolution. Beings that had lost everything. Everything but brute strength and survival instinct. That's what they've become. Monsters. The monsters that we're fighting are the Natibas. Natibas. They were humans. Then, those we've killed so far, they were all humans. I can't believe this. But this production facility was definitely made for Natibas. If the Natibas were human, we, the ones fighting against humans, must be. Andro Ados. Are we Andro Ados? Creatures brought into existence, created by Mother Sphere. No, we're humans. Humans with complete bodies, perfectly in harmony with machinery and living tissue. The Tebas, on the other hand, are incomplete because they are made only of living tissue. They can't adapt to different environments and they can't even survive in space. But what if? We were created to solve such imperfections. What? Then, why did Mother Sphere hide this truth from us? I need to think. Yes. I don't think we can reach a conclusion about this on our own. I really do think we should talk to Orkel about all this. Yes, let's do that. Let's do that. 